<laughs> so welcome. So we're going through just four of sort of the plus line products that have extra caffeine in them. So we all, every once in a while, need just that extra boost, um, just depending on what your day is looking like. And so we have four sort of main things that have that extra caffeine that we tend to use. So I'm not gonna really go into any of like the DFTs that have caffeine since we did that last week, but we're going to be looking at Activate, Cafe, the Pure Shots, and um, Thirst. Yeah, there we go, that last one. Thirst plus caffeine. So we're gonna start with the one that has the least amount of caffeine, which is Activate, which comes in two flavors. So we have the watermelon, and we have mango strawberry. And each of these have about 50 milligrams of caffeine in them. So this is sort of the least amount of caffeine for some of our extra ones. But these are Activate and our Cafe both have this really cool um, non-essential amino acid called L-tyrosin. -ty I hope I said that right. If not, that's okay. <laughs> 50, sorry. Five zero. If I talk a little funny, I had dental work done, so I'm still, I sound funny at the moment. <laughs> but I sound funnier if I have the fake tooth in, so. <laughs> but the Activate and Cafe both have L-tyrosin, which I can type in the, ch in the chat because it's a weird word. And this is a non-essential amino acid, and it's created naturally in our bodies. And so it uses a couple of other amino acids that help um, with producing enzymes, um, or helps with our thyroid ho hormones and sort of skin pigmentation. But your body is naturally going to regulate this. So you can't really overdo it. Um, so it naturally regulate, regulates this. And it's been shown to really help with mental alertness. And in a study that had people staying up for over 24 hours and then completing certain tasks, were able to complete these tasks without too much delay compared to others who didn't have this supplement and were asked to do the same tasks. And it's also been used um, and looked at for antidepressants. And so, and it, um, Sorry, it turns sort of some of our brain chemicals um, of dopamine and helps to um, make some of those connections in our brain using this amino acid. Another really cool one that is in here um, is L -tyro tyrane. Sorry, some of these words are weird. <laughs> but this one is meant to help with sports performance. So the sports performance, um, it's found in a lot of energy drinks. And there are studies that showed um, with this one that they gave to mice and they were able to like keep running for longer. So I just keep thinking of like really buff mice, like running forever. But it was also used for like cross country runners and they were able to go for a longer time and it helped with their muscle. Um, it had a lot of muscle support and helping them to recover and to be able to go longer. And so I know a lot of people, my husband uses Activate before he goes to work out. And it's just that little bit of a boost. But one other really cool thing with Activate that isn't really performance related or um, activity related is that it has this um, type of sugar. It's B8 or incital, incital. If I'm pronouncing that right, I'll type it in the chat. So, incital um, is, oops, I can spell it right. Inositol, there we go. But this is a type of sugar, so it's B8, so it's not particularly a vitamin, but it plays a really important role with your cell membranes. It influences the actions of insulin. And so with this, it could actually help people. They had studies that showed that it helps with people with PCOS when used along with folic acid, which our three steps already has. And it was found that if they took 
in one study, they had four grams of this plus about 400 um, MCGs of folic acid taken daily for about three months, about 62% of the treated women were ovulating when they previously weren't, which I thought was a really cool study with this. And so that's sort of our first one. So it has 50 milligrams of that extra caffeine. But our next is cafe. And we have a lot of different ones. So cafe has 90 milligrams of caffeine. And this one has a lot of antioxidants and a lot of those normal vitamins that we find in our three steps as well. And it also has the um, L-tyrosin -tyro like activate. And then it has the black pepper fruit extract, which really just helps your body to be able to use some of the other vitamins in there. So that one doesn't have as much of some of those different um, things because I've been really looking at sort of those proprietary blends because all the other vitamins that are sort of normal vitamins that we see in each of our steps, but the proprietary blends are sort of where it gets really cool. And then our next one, and cafe is one of those that can actually be warm. You can heat it up and have it warm or you can have it cold. So I like doing it if I want something warm to drink and a little bit of extra boost for the day. Then our next is the pure shots. So I've not actually tried one of these. I have a couple, but they have 120 milligrams of caffeine in them. And they have this, um, in acetyl l tyrosin which is like the tyrosin that the previous two had, but this one is a little bit more soluble and heat resistant, and it's actually more bioavailable to our body. So it's easier for our bodies to be able to use this. And so it's something that's made from l tyrosin but it's sort of altered a little bit to be able to use by our bodies a little easier. And then, it also has the Tyron, which is the helping for your sports um, activist people who um, are mm -hmm. wanting to go and work out a little bit more. So it has that muscle support to help them to go a little bit longer. And it also has this um, gamma, GABA, which what is the caffeine source in cafe? It just says caffeine. So I would have to message the port and ask. A couple of these, it just says caffeine. Um, from what the other ones have been, it's been like green tea and sort of green tea extracts. So I'm assuming that it's probably about the same as that because with coffee, um, caffeine, it wouldn't have that sort of prolonged being able to go. So. I would have to double check on where the caffeine source is because it just it just says caffeine. But so in our pure shot, it has I cannot say the full name of this, but it's GABA, and this is a natural occurring amino acid, and it works as a neurotransmitter in your brain. So this attaches to proteins in your brain, and it can block certain signals and decreases the activity, creating like a calming effect. And so some people take this as a supplement for that calming effect. So research on it as a supplement for being a calming effect, um, since this does naturally occur in our bodies as well, they don't quite know how much gets into our brains to do this, but there's been preliminary research into how that works. And then our last, and newest caffeine product is the Thrive Thirst with the infused caffeine. And this one has the most caffeine with 150 milligrams. And this one is really promoting for rehydration. So there's one without any caffeine and then there's the one with caffeine, but it has Himalayan pink salts and coconut water to really help replenish your electrolytes. So when you're out and sweating and just doing sort of normal day-to-day -day things in the summer, it helps to replenish the salts in those electrolytes. But Himalayan pink salt has about a third of the sodium that natural table salt has. And most people are getting enough salt in their diet. So they don't really need to add any extra salts 
or too much extra salt and sodium, but it also has a few other nutrients along with it. And then um, the coconut water has lots of potassium, which a lot of people sort of lack in some of these vitamins, especially if they're not eating a very well-rounded diet. And so with all of the caffeine in this guy, personal experience, do not take this and then have something very sugary, like a big margarita, or you sound like you're on some form of a drug and bouncing off the walls till midnight. <laughs> Might've tried that the first time I did this. And I was like, I took it early in the morning, then I had a big margarita for dinner and I didn't go to bed till like midnight. So the caffeine really works. But those are sort of the four extra um, plus line products that have that extra caffeine. So some of them are really great for um, those athletes that you know that want a little bit um, more power and sort of extra muscle recovery and to get them going in their workouts. And just if you ever need a little boost during the day, I know for me personally, if I want a little bit of an extra boost in the afternoon, I love Activate because it's just enough to sort of wake you up and get you going again. But that is all. I don't know if Dakota or anyone would like to add anything. Nope, you're doing wonderful. <laughs> but those are all of the extra ca caffeinated plus line products. But, <laughs> ooh, I haven't tried it in rum. <laughs> but that is all I have for you all tonight. So thank you all for joining us. I always love talking about all these things, even if I can't pronounce some of the words tonight, which I apologize. Um, thank you for hosting. <laughs> but thank you all. Bye. <laughs>